So we're here at Laguna for our first race of the year in the uh, Porsche RSR. Um, it's been a pretty late program or deal that came together. Um, it was just in January this year. Um, you know, I've, I've known the team all of last year, racing the, the LMPC with Alex, Alex Popov. Um, so for me, there's nothing new apart from the car. So you know, to have Pat here, who's going to uh, guide me and guide the team. Uh, you know, we're going to have a lot of learning to do with the car. Um, but you know the team's been been pretty brilliant so far. It's a young team. Um, every year that they've competed, they've won the championship. So you know, I have no doubts in the capability of the team. We have just got to learn, learn the car. Um, you know, there's no expectations for this year. Um, so you know, I think this weekend we're going to uh, really understand exactly where we are in the field. You know, as a driver, you always want to be at the front, but this is a bit of a long-term program. It's not not for just this year. So uh, I think we just got to learn as much as we can and gather as much information, and uh, hopefully by the end of the year we should get some good results. Yeah, it's been uh, about 10 years that I've been driving an RSR and ALMS with lots of different organizations, and uh, that's helped me sort of grow with the race car and uh, understand what it needs from a setup standpoint and how to drive it. Uh, with that, I'm happy to give uh, my playbook to Tom and to the team wherever I can, but also not to be too much in the way. These guys know what they're doing. Uh, an example was we went to our first test this year after the 12 hours of Sebring, and uh, uh, the track went green at 9 o'clock and at 8.59 we were rolling out of our pit box. So although we're doing this on a relaxed basis and we really need to get up to speed with the series and how it all works, it's all business with Morgan and the team. Uh, Gary's done a phenomenal job as the engineer to really get up to speed quickly with how a 911 works, obviously with the engine in the wrong side, if you will, or in the back. Uh, it takes a little bit of a different engineering style, but right, right away uh, Gary was on top of it. Tom's done a great job coming out of an LMP car, which really does what you ask it to do to a 911 that sometimes fights back a little bit and uh, all in all I think the progression has been very quick and uh, we're really hopeful for our prospects straight out of the gate on weekend one here in Laguna. It's a, it's a massive change I think the last time I drove a GT, uh, GTE car competitively was uh, way back in 2007 in the panels so you know since 2007 I've been pr predominantly based in the LMP2 series um, so you know like Pat said, the LMP2 car basically does everything you want it to do, where the Porsche will fight back 99% of the time, and uh, you know it's a, quite a challenge. It's hard to know what to expect. I think realistically, uh, we'll judge our performance on how we did as a team. If we hit all our marks and and basically just operated the whole weekend and didn't miss a beat, that would be an A plus weekend for us. Uh, the race result could reflect better than we hoped or worse than we hoped, but ultimately, I think we have to judge our own performance on what we know we're capable of.